the only prophet and personal assistant that served three governments or four. The first government he served was under the king Nebuchadnezzar. He served Beshezer. He served Dairos. Three governments is a hell of achievements for one prophet. He controlled this government. And people will look at him today and say, Daniel is not a good prophet. Why is he in the king's palace? Why is he following the king? Don't you see all the nonsense the king is? Can I tell you? Until you get God's perspective, don't make a conclusion. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. I'm teaching you from the book of experience. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Now, Matthew chapter 6. Let me show you something. Even our own king, our own lord, had to tell us something about perspective. Jesus came to the region of Caesarea Philippi. Yes. He asked his disciples. He asked his disciples. Who do people say the son of man is? Now this is people's this is people's perspective. Now watch. Why was he bothered? He's trying to teach us the kind of perspective. Now he said to them, who do people say because every statement is a product of a thought. Yes, Before people conclude on you, they have concluded by the thought. Yes, so it is the thought that produces the statement. So he said to them, what do people or who do people say I am? That's what people's perspective. Read on. They replied. They answered him. Some say some say John the Baptist this is reincarnation people they believe you are the, a reincarnation of John even though John senior for six months they believe you are a reincarnation they still believe in reincarnation even with a wrong doctrine they were analyzing Jesus but they think we, we, you are the reincarnated John in fact let me tell you the truth the reincarnation story of Jesus was not a small business. It was not small like you read in the Bible. Even Herod, it became a very big propaganda. Even Herod believed that Jesus was John the Baptist. Remember, he's his cousin in the natural flesh. So there must be a resemblance that Jesus has with John because they are operating similar genes. So when John was in prison and was killed, Jesus started his ministry. And anytime Herod looks at Jesus, he sees a striking resemblance of John. Therefore, it became a notion in the ideas of those who are close to Herod that this Jesus was the reincarnation of John the Baptist. So when Jesus said, who do men say I am? They first of all gave the Herod perspective, which was, you are John the, the Baptist. Baptist. I don't know if somebody's catching what I'm saying. Oh, yes. The day Jesus went to meet Herod eh, in the court of Herod's palace, there was something Herod did to pay back the debt, the unjust killing of John the Baptist. Now, watch what he did. When Christ came before him, he was panicking. Some of you don't read these things in the Bible. The only thing you know, my God shall supply all my needs. Be a Bible student. He stood before. Herod and Herod was panicking. He was, hey, this is John. Now look at his hair. Look at him. Look at his John. You know what he did? He pulled his royal purple garment and placed it on the body of Jesus. Say, so wear it. Sorry that I killed you. <laughs> so Jesus went into the Her into Herod's palace as a Nazarite but came out as the king 